The title of this video is What You Listen To Is How You Think. Listen wisely. So, the title really, really says it all about this short video that I want to make. I see so many people out there don't get this. That what you listen to on a continuous basis, that's actually the message that you're building your brain with every single day and that's how you're going to act in life. I see so many people watching the news and watching this and watching that and watching this and watching that and listen to this and listen to that and it's all negative and it's half the it's bullshit anyway, it's just their own opinions and it's not serving you at all. And because you're sucking all these negative belief systems, guess what? Now you actually start to think like that. And so I'll give you a little story is that I used to be, you know, and, and how you know, or should I say how you know this is that sometimes you can, you know, sometimes you actually go through changes in your life and you start to look at people saying, why are you being so negative for? Uh, I, used to, I used to be friends, I used to be, I used to be, uh, you know, with friends uh, at my church for a long time, over 10 years. And I was with them and I didn't think anything and I was talking to them and stuff like that and, you know, just, just being with them for a long, for, for a long time, as I, said, as I said before, over 10 years. And then I started to read Tony Robbins and really immerse myself into, you know, investing and personal development. And I went to Tony Robbins' event and I started changing the way I was thinking and changing the way I see things. And suddenly I went to church one day and all my friends were negative. And I started saying, why are you guys, guys, why are you guys so negative for? And I'm like, what are you talking about? And I said, you're weird, John. You're weird. And I sat there and I thought, did they change or did I change? Because for things to change, you need to change. So I looked at that and I thought, interesting, I'm seeing things differently now than I was before because I was listening to different people. Now, that was a good thing, right? Because it was about personal development, it was about personal growth. It was actually helping me to, to achieve what I've achieved so far in my life. And a lot more of them moving forward. So because I was listening to that, I actually started changing. I started seeing things differently. And then I realized that I was so negative before. Why was I so negative before? Because I was around the people that all they kept talking about was negative bullshit all the time. So I, that's how I just talked and that's how I was, right? So whatever you're listening to, be careful what you listen to. Jim Rohn said to Tony Robbins, and Tony Robbins, I learned this from Tony Robbins, but stand guard of your mind. That's like stand guard of whatever's going into this thing. Because I'm telling you right now guys, and I've made this fatal mistake, it can ruin your life if you hang around the wrong people, if you listen to the wrong bullshit all the time. You know, it's like, if you're listening to the news every night, guess what? Nothing good is going to come from that. You're going to hear a car accident, someone got stabbed, someone got shot. And guess what? If they can't find anything local, or if they can't, if they can't find anything in your country, they're going to go overseas to find some bad news. It's like, how is that supporting you? I don't watch the news. I hardly ever read the newspaper. I like listening to positive music, I like li watch, listen to positive videos, because guess what guys, success is hard, you know, moving forward is hard, and if you're going to be listening to all this, all this negative stuff, remember, 80% of, of your success is, is mindset. So if we listen to all this sort of stuff, it's not helping us move forward, it's actually bogging us down. It's like, man, enough's enough, I've had it, I'm moving forward. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? Now it's like, that's what Jim, Jim Rohn says. I've had it! Blowing the card and smell the rings! You know, God, God, God rest his soul. But be careful what you listen to, you know, because some people don't realize that, you know, they, it's like, but John, you don't understand. I need, I need to know that. It's like there's this one YouTube channel that I know one of my trading clients, old trading clients, who used to, used to listen to it all the time. And the way he talked, it was like, you're not helping yourself at all. 80% is your mindset. 80% is your mindset. And we all know that. It's how you see things. When you look, when you look at, you know, when, for things to change, you need to change. When you, when you look at, when you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. Like I was with my, with my, with my, with my friends at church. And it was like, uh, it was like, um, 
uh, yeah, it was just like I started seeing a whole new world. And by me opening my mind and seeing things as they are and what they really are, and I wasn't having now blinders on, I'm like, I'm starting to see things now. I'm starting to really, really see things. I'm starting to understand things a bit more. And I could see things more and I could really move forward in a big way. But guys, success is hard itself. You know, you've got to, you've got to be able to deal with failure. You've got to be able to deal with things not working. You've got to be able to deal with people around you, you know, pulling you down. And then you've got to be able to, which is the biggest thing of all, you've got to be able to deal with yourself, your mindset, your limiting beliefs, your values, your belief systems, your fear of failure, your fear of success. Do, do, you, do you feel like you deserve this money or this freedom or this health? You know, it's like all these things we've got to overcome for, overcome with in our brains. Make sense? So, anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Just be careful what you listen to. And if you're noticing yourself listening to negative shit all the time, you gotta really start changing that and forcing yourself to stop listening to it. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Hey, it's John Howell here again. If you like this video, then hit that like button and share this video with your friends to help them out as well. I really appreciate you sharing this video around with your friends and family. If you did like this video, then you're really going to like my brand new book called The Flow of Success. Tap into the top 19 powerful universal laws to succeed in every area of your life faster and easier than ever before. As I record this video, I'm doing a special launch price, so click on the book image or there's a link in the description as well to check it out to check the actual book as well on Amazon. Remember, success can be yours if you go claim it, so step up, take massive action and face your fears today.